Hello everybody, I'm Evangelist Robert Roberts with I Thirst Ministries. Uh, we've been in the ministry for 11 years preaching our own ministry for about three years now. Uh, I Thirst Ministry, the name came from a revelation of God that people are thirsty not just for a drink, but they're also thirsty for the, the, the loving kindness and the grace that Jesus Christ provides for us. If we'll just stop and believe in Him. Um, some of the things we believe is that we believe that Jesus died on the cross and was rose on the third day. We also believe that the, in the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, that they're three in one, the great trinity. We also believe that the healing power or the miracle power of God that, that we have even seen in our ministry already, that cancer being healed and people got out of wheelchairs. We've seen broken bones put back together, deaf ears healed depression gone and lives changed for the better of their selves through the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. That's the things that we believe in our ministry. Um, in, in Romans chapter 1 verse 16 it says, For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God unto the salvation everyone that believeth to the Jew first and also the Greek. For within the righteousness of God revealed from the faith to faith also it was written that they shall live by faith. We believe in that you have to have faith in God to be healed, to be set free, and to be delivered. But you, you have to have Jesus Christ as your ambassador, as your savior, as your guide. When you see him and you see what he has done in, in your life and you realize that all the blessings you have on a daily basis, just in your own little life, that... There's things that, that God has done even for us that, that I would love to tell you about how he let us overcome the loss of a baby. And, and he gave us Matthew, which means gift from God and is full of the Holy Ghost and, and, and is a great little minister when, he, when, when, when the Holy Ghost hits him. And, and, and the things that, that God has blessed me with, two loving stepchildren that I call my own. There's things that God has done for us and I would love to share them with your church. Not just that, the testimonies of me being healed from cancer, being smushed between two trucks, being rolled down a 90-foot cliff on a four-wheeler where the gun came apart. They could have went off, but God decided to spare me. Not to mention that when the, I had the cancer, my throat got cut to take it out, and they said I wouldn't want to speak, but I'm speaking to you right now. All I ask is for a chance to come and just minister to your people. Um, we'll follow you under your guidelines and your directions as your church uh, requires, but we ask you to let us flow in the spirit freely for God has gave us freedom in the spirit. I promise you, we will not disappoint you. And I promise you, you will see miracles happen that day in the church. I believe it. I come expecting. And all I ask you to do is come with me expecting when you invite us, uh, you can get in touch with us at 205-240-5066. Or you can email me at evangelistrr at gmail.com or you can look at me up on Facebook if you search Evangelist Robert Roberts it's the first one that comes up and I'm just be excited and, and honored to come and minister to your church no matter where the state is or what's going on we do not require any fees or any kind of travel expenses we believe God will provide for us so if you decide to do a love offering that is fine if not we still believe that God is going to provide for us for this ministry uh, we have states that we've already been to and the states we're going back to again and i hope your state is one of the states that get to hear this this anointing power of god that has rested upon our lives powerful life changing ministry that we have and we just thank god that you are even given considering a chance for us to be part of your ministry to extend our hand to you to help you minister to give you a break or just to let the holy spirit flow Father, I'm going to pray for the churches. Father, I ask you whatever church this attaches to, Father, whatever church hears this message, Father, I ask you that you just come and saturate and saturate their land, Father. Father, I ask you to, to, to fill their house with the Shekinah glory, Father, that is everlasting. Father, Like just like you were in there, Father, as they minister and they sing praises unto you, Father. Father, I ask you to ordain and appoint the minister of whoever is speaking that day, that they may be like you were on the mountain speaking, Father. Father, I ask you to anoint and send my healing virtue that you have gave us in our ministry, Father, to their hands as of even right now before I even show up. 
that when they lay hands on people, they will also see cancer gone. Broken hands and broken legs put back together. Families put back together. Father, we just thank you for who you are and everything you do. Father, we just thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.